What's happening, Reject Nation? I'm here with my buddy, Arshad. What up, Reject Nation? <laughs> what up, Reject Nation? You might have seen him on the Jabby Koei channel five years ago, but I met him five weeks ago. Hell yeah, <laughs> baby. And we just kicked it off. Johnny buddy. Boy is uh, in surgery, out of commission for a few days, and I said, now's the time for Arshad to sneak on in here with me. <laughs> I've been, I've Not even wish him better. No, no, no. He's like, oh, now's the time. No, screw that. While he's down. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be texting him later. We've never seen the trailer for The Atom Project. All we know is it's the same people who made Free Guy. Mm -hmm. I've been wanting to watch this movie right when I heard that, and I figured we'd get along. Yeah. So let's watch a movie together. Let's right? do it. Full length watch along as we sync with the time code for The Atom Project over at our Patreon page. Become a super reject by checking out all the crap we got to offer over there. Now, if you don't want to do that, the least you can do is leave a damn like. Yeah. Leave a like. And then boys at Prepper, thank you for helping us set it down these highlights. <laughs> let's get to it. Hal Jordan! Uh-oh. If you don't abort right now, I will shoot you out of I'm sorry to interrupt what I'm sure is gonna be a really scary threat, but if I'm right, your tracking system is about to... crash. Whoa. It's like a video game. <laughs> Okay. That's a that's that a, that's opening a it up. audience. Yeah, okay. Who are watching on their the couches. The Adam Project. Yeah. No more jokes? Oh, I'm gonna enjoy this. Who talks like that? Did you order like a bully starter kit on Amazon <laughs> or something? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god. Oh, and he has an inhaler. Was it Ray Dollarhide again? It's barely been a year since we lost his father. You could show some compassion. Exposition. Exposition. If Good that, exposition. If that, if that wasn't anything. <laughs> He's twice your size. Everyone is twice my size. I've seen babies bigger than me. I don't understand you. Dad would. And he's dead. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> It's the third time you've been suspended for fighting. I know, you think I'd be better at it by now. This goes on your permanent record. Do you get that? Do you care about your future? He's sassy. You're going on a date. It's not a date. I don't think it's a date. Your dress thinks it's a date? Oh, it is a date. I am going on a date. Where am I going on a date? <laughs> Can I please stop saying date now? Thanks. Oh my god, he's <laughs> such a smart ass. <laughs> He's doing such a good ride, Reynolds. It's I know, so he's good. Just a little ride. It's riding. so good. <laughs> Ooh. Hawking? Dog's name Hawking? Hawking. Okay. Like Hawkins from Stranger Things? That's a, yeah. Spaceship. Yeah, there's some real like and it's something. Amblin entertainment yeah. vibes about this thing. <laughs> Girl <laughs> Yeah boy you been <laughs> something happening. <laughs> Start scoring real quick. Put the bat the down. Are you? Just put the bat down. I'm not gonna hurt you, I promise. What are you doing in here? I'm you, bitch. Where's your mother? On a date. Oh, with who? I don't know. Derek? Derek. That's, yes, the guy with the, um, with the mouth mullet. The goatee? Yeah. <laughs> mouth mullet. <laughs> 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 oh. oh. I'm gonna get some stuff. Careful with that. Stay here. He got some reflexes, that's for sure. If we didn't have a clue as to is, who he was, is he this would John be really Lick, or Who is he? Yeah. <laughs> what, what is his, like, what's his, we don't know yet. Don't touch my stuff. Is this a lightsaber? No, it's not a lightsaber. No, <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, that bullet went straight through. That's good. Pass. Wait, 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 wait. Bullet? You were shot? Yeah, no, actually, no. No, I was stabbed. With a bullet. <laughs> <laughs> What's with the lightsaber? It's not a lightsaber. Jesus Christ, Adam, I need you to play Wait. it cool. I know that playing it cool Wait. isn't really your thing. Wait. Oh, I said his name. How do you know my name? 
You're Adam Reed, born February 10th. You go to Franklin Middle School, where you've been suspended two, maybe three times for fighting, which is ironic, because you can't fight to save your life. Okay, zip it! How do you know my dog's name? Because I named him. <gasps> Where are you going? <laughs> this is adorable. I'm like in it. You're wearing my dad's watch. <laughs> it's for me. That's classified, but yes. <laughs> Dude, you're so lucky. You get to grow up to be a Ryan Reynolds. That's, That's amazing. Me. That Yeah. That's a dream <laughs> right there. Fine, can you at least tell me how you got here? I'll show you. Ah. Uh... There she is. <laughs> this is so freaking cute. It is. That's such a great sense of wonder. Yeah. I love this. If I was little, I would probably watch this movie like every day <laughs> it has an 80s side yeah it's, it's like flight of the navigator yeah. almost even yeah a bit of star man yeah this kid's a star i had no intention of coming back to revisit this jesus <laughs> you're, you're gonna do yourself any favors by putting yourself down <laughs> do you remember this remember what this Right here, right now. You being here in 2022. Good question. You may have just changed my whole future. Honestly, your future is pretty tragic either way. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm not kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> this is so freaking adorable. <laughs> he clearly doesn't like who he is on the inside in a lot of ways. Oh my God, oh my she's God. in this too? I feel like we're up for one more surprise. I, had, I knew nothing about this, so this yeah, is right. clearly a novel or a book, right? The way it's, or it's a great script, but it feels like a book. Will you be seeing him again? No, I don't know, I don't think so. He's such a, he's such a dick. I love this kid. Hello, Derek. You have a wonderful mouth mullet and you must be very proud. Oh my gosh, Adam. <laughs> I've never actually heard it called that before. <laughs> you can be a real jerk sometimes. You know that? This is why I time travel back. I mean, it's a little toxic of mom to say that to her kid. Just saying. He has to know. Just saying. He has to know. <laughs> I'm your mother, I'll let you know. Aww. Oh my god. This is like an intro. This movie is hitting me. <laughs> this is how your dad did it. Hey, grab a pile. Sorry, I gotta get to my room to think about what I've done. Wow. Oh, wow. Call me if you need me. I won't. God wow. damn. Dude. What a little shit. No wonder you grew up into mean Ryan Reynolds. Wow. I don't I don't get I don't see kids represent like Wait, represented like that. That's Mark Ruffalo? Yeah. <laughs> is that, <laughs> that was Wow, this cast is stacked. <laughs> <laughs> Dad's favorite song. Yeah, me too. Dang, look at him. He's just built. He is just built. <laughs> He's gonna be like, Dang, I look good. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? He's like... <laughs> what? I just... You're... kind of ripped. <laughs> 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 Wait, do we get a lot of girls and colleagues? Adam! I... Time travel exists. <laughs> Every conceptual idea you have about the universe has just been thrown out the window, yet your big question is, do I get laid? Do I? Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you wear some of Dad's clothes? Oh, what a beautiful script. She's not much of a housekeeper. Hey. She wakes up every morning with a broken heart and a, and, a, and a closet full of his clothes and gets nothing from you but a fistful of crap. I'm you, oh, you know. Tell me about it. You know, 30 years, you still get sick to your stomach every time you remember how you treated her now. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> this is, this is good, dude. This is yeah. a good, this is a solid ass movie. 
<laughs> time, time after time. time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys. Enjoying our suspension? I am now. Oh, oh. that's my spleen. <laughs> I remember these little turd burpers. Turd burpers. He's got a big mouth. I get it. Point is, this fight needs to happen right now. <laughs> 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 so here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna walk over there and you're gonna raise your hands. And then you're gonna look Ray right in the eye. Then you're gonna drop down to your knees and punch him as hard as you can in the private bathing suit bar. <laughs> I'm gonna smoke your banana. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. no. That, that's not what we talked about. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. Oh, yeah. oh, my God. Oh, no, Chuck. Look, we made him cry. Trying to lose. Aww. Aww. Ever hear the expression, every bully has a bully, Ray? If you go near Adam again, I'll know. I will pull bones out of your body. I will sharpen them, and I will use them to stab little Chucky over here. What did I do? <laughs> <laughs> God, I hated those assholes. Mm, this is, like, one of the best, like, kids' movies in a long time. Every bully has a bully. Yeah. That's, wow. I'm Rashad's bully. You wish. Punk. That was from Harry Potter. You wish. <laughs> Who's this? Who's who? That's my wife, Laura. You have a wife? No, we do not have a wife anymore. Mm. Oh, no. Thanos' daughter. Is this Disney? This is the multiverse. It, it, it is the multiverse. <laughs> yeah. Babies, pure love. They grow into teenagers who grow into be assassins of happiness. Mm. Thank you, thank you. I'm ready for this. I wish I knew what I was doing wrong. You're not doing anything wrong. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, you oh, oh my god, this is gonna be like a Back to the Future thing, isn't it? No, I hope not. <laughs> I hope this is endearing. Boys always come back with their mamas. It sounds like you're speaking from experience. I am. You have a good mom. I have the best mom. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Aren't you grieving too? Of course I am. So tell him. I don't think he needs you it. You think you're being strong for him. And the problem with acting like you have it all together is he believes it. Maybe he needs to know that you don't. <laughs> it's okay if you don't. Wow. That's beautiful. My husband had a jacket just like that. Oh this is classic. He loves you. Well, then he knows. You better return that jacket now. It's gonna look real suspicious. Wow. Yeah. What a fucking amazing script. Hey! Hey! What was she gonna say? I think you're my son? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're my say? son from the future? Hey! <laughs> I pieced it together. <laughs> it's a feeling, you know? <gasps> I bad forgot guys. about all this. The bad guys. <laughs> the bad guys. Whoa. Find him. So you came back for your wife, Laura? We're not getting into that. Hey, she's my wife, too. <laughs> Somebody was hiding something. Maybe she saw something that Sorian didn't want her to see. We're going that way. Be ready. Cool. <laughs> Don't you do it. Don't you do it, Reed. You want to see something cool? That's a lightsaber. That is a lightsaber. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, awesome. What is happening? What? So insult on that. Oh my god, is it her? <laughs> it is her! This is so fun. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> <laughs> We should go. Yep, let's go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my god, I love this. Damn. You get to grow up to be Ryan Reynolds I, and marry her. 
And that's her new family. You got a great life ahead of you, kid. He literally has his parents now. Yeah. <laughs> nope, nope, someone just died. <laughs> like Return of the Jedi. Woo! I'm like, in this. <laughs> they're not leaving, they're regrouping. We have to get off this road fast. What road? It's like Terminator 2 with them. Mm. Someone went back and altered the time stream so the future the jet had left from had already been changed. God, it's like I traded my brains for those muscles. <laughs> Sorian must have come back to 2018 and given her younger self some kind of future intel. And get rid of whatever political obstacles were keeping her from gaining total control of the time program. She already had that. But did she? No. No, she didn't. That's a lot of information. Even if we correct the time stream, somewhere in us will be the echo of this one. And we will find each other. Oh, I really hope so. I love you. That's why I know you're gonna find me again. Go! Boom. Shoot him. We can fix it. By destroying time travel. That's right. And how are you going to do that? What's your plan? Well, I'm not going to explain my plan to a 12 year old nerd with an you inhaler don't because have I do not a plan. have a plan. <laughs> 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 Dad. Dad! Oh my god! Yeah. So are you in? This is so good. <laughs> Tell your husband to get his bitch ass out here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just when you think it's like a hundred percent family film, it's like tell your husband. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man, what bitch? Fucking bitch. Straight up. Maybe she missed. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe she missed. Like it was a warning shot. <laughs> Hang on. God, Independence Day. This movie has everything. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the hottest nightclub is this movie. Did you just turn the plane off? Yes, I did. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. You really are the best damn pilot. We don't pull this off. We're not getting back, either one of us. Change your destiny. Punch that shit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Can you imagine if they cast Mark Ruffalo just for the photos? <laughs> 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 This, mo this movie has everything. everything. <laughs> Everything's in it. Now we see Professor Hulk. Let's yeah. go. To quote the Romans, enjoy yourselves. It's later than you think. Guy Lombardo. Do I know you? Just taught it in the class. You're my son. You're my son. <laughs> <laughs> I did it. I figured it out, didn't I? <laughs> Everybody, everybody get out of here. Uh, yeah. This, this guy is interesting. <laughs> Something about you, mysterious man in the back. It's Deadpool and Hulk interacting. <laughs> Adam? 
Holy shit, oh, wh- he what? did do it. He is smart. Dad. Whoa. What? Dad. He knows. Yeah. Can you please just shut up for a second? No, I'm listen. not gonna listen. For a second I'm not gonna and listen, listen to me. Because what you're you doing is in your face. Is not- wow. I'm mean, just playing with the theory that you can use wormholes for time travel. But that part's theoretical. Right. Still theoretical. Well, this theory needs to take a leak, so let's go. Holy shit. I'm the godfather of time travel? <laughs> <laughs> Stop being a scientist. But I am a scientist. Be a father. You're always more interested in the universe than you were your own son. That's not true. That is true, and when you're older, you'll realize that. It, that ship has sailed. It's too late for me, so, you know, whatever. I'm fine. Man. <sighs> it's Ryan Reynolds for you. It's what it is. Or you can get left behind in the past. Hang up the phone. Oh, shit. You hate him because he died. I think it's easier to be angry than it is to be sad. And I guess when I get older, I forget that there's a difference. How'd you get to be so smart? How'd you get to be so dumb? <laughs> I have good news for you. He doesn't need perfect. He just needs you. You know I love you. Yeah, I know. I'm extremely lovable. She is the best movie mom of the cur- yeah. of, of the current times. You got time. Yeah. It's later than you think. <laughs> she don't know what's up. <laughs> she don't know what's up, though. <laughs> On your knees, I won't tell you again. Adam, what are you doing? I'm about to get my ass kicked. I've been waiting my whole life for this. Then drop down and hit him in the front of bathing suit. Roger that. Nice work. Lucky duck. That was invigorating! Dad? Dad? I'm sorry, are you okay? This close! That was amazing. Uh, hey, hey, hey! hey. It's your mother's car! The car? <laughs> I am so keeping this thing. No, you ain't, little Adam. Feel the vibrations, kid. Mm -mm. Sorry, little Adam. One of two things. The accelerator will continue to run on a dormant loop. Or? Or there's a cataclysmic meltdown that will destroy all living things within 100 miles. Screw it. (laughs) (laughs) Maya? Long time no see. Oh, such such. Give me the drive. No. If I shoot him, you die too. Adam, I'm thinking it over. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? That's it's a big that's decision. It's not a big decision. I need to think it through. I'm about to lose my shit here. <laughs> right, <laughs> man. Just, just give her the drive. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, Adam. Get me that drive now! <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Oh, he did. <laughs> I want my try. You can't have it. Shoot him. Damn, in the middle of this. Do it. Maya, you're better than this. Sorry, Lewis, but you brought this on yourself. Oh no, Maya. Ask your son how I play. I had to kill his wife. Twice. What? What? (laughs) Oh shit. Damn. She, I love how Ryan Reynolds knew that. His face was like, ooh, he's not gonna be. You never understood the science. <laughs> Dad, I was dusted. <laughs> You're my boy, and I love you. I loved you from the first minute that I saw you, and that will never change. Adam. Dad. 
You're yeah, my boy. You? <laughs> I hate to say it, but you were the best part all along. Are we gonna smoke this banana? I said Play ball! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, some really touching shit, man. <laughs> My throat. <laughs> it's a little, got a little, it's a little scratchy. <laughs> but he gets to have the memories. This is how your dad did it. Hey, grab a pile, would you? I'll be late for school. Oh my gosh, you're right. Okay, have a great day, honey. This shit is fucking me up right now, <laughs> man. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> wow, he shaved his beard, he looks 30 years younger. <laughs> He's been talking for 15 minutes. He managed to put the entire class to sleep. You look awake. No. Train myself to, to to fall fast asleep and keep my eyes open. <laughs> What's your field? Um, computational linguistics. No way. Yeah. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I can I can walk you to Schaefer. Are you sure? I mean, I would hate to disturb your sleep. I've, uh, I got time. Clever. That's clever. Yeah. This is so cute. Oh, dude. Damn. They did that. They did that. All their memories are going to come back. Yeah. <laughs> like a nightmare. That hit on a lot of real personal notes in my life. Ooh. God damn, that was really hitting me. <laughs> like, I was not prepared for it. <laughs> Just how God a lot of shit, yeah. man. It just invited me over to like cry oh, for like an hour. It's just, it's just an hour and a half for traffic for man. <laughs> that was way more heartfelt than I expected. To be. Yeah, I didn't expect anything. I thought it, I thought free guy, <laughs> funny. <laughs> then I was like, wow, this is so much. But more free guy had a good, a lot of moments yeah. too. A, a lot of moments. Had a lot of heart, but that yeah. this was this is like another level of emotional. Yeah. <laughs> It's like generational father-son storytelling. When do we talk about this? <laughs> we have begun. We are begun. <laughs> it's begun. No, well, uh... Are we waiting for it? this to end, or what? How does it... I guess we're just waiting for the credits to... Okay. I'm trying to see if they're copying Marvel so much to give us a post credit scene. All right. Yes, we have taken a standing break for 20 seconds, and now we are here talking. <laughs> That is what is happening in the video. Yes. We are talking. We, have, we are talking we have about it. We explained it. it. Uh, that was awesome. It was nice to see Ryan Reynolds also bring um, his, like, you know, that, that you know, comedy sarcasm, but do a different character at the same time. So yeah. A lot more. Like, I tried watching the other Netflix film he did, Red Notice. Have you heard of that movie? Red I've Notice. heard of it, but I didn't watch it. I could not finish. It was Dwayne Johnson, or Ryan Reynolds, and I, and I was like, I, I'm over this. <laughs> and, right. But this, I, I really, I really enjoyed his performance a lot. But I thought what was really special about it, and it, and I'm sure this movie hits the feels for a lot of people. Yeah. And I've, I've expressed this before around the time, of like around 2013 is when my, when my dad died. So I've was finding myself like my relationship with my dad was not like this i would say right. <laughs> but from on a personal level um you know and as someone who's been in therapy for so many years on top of that i was appreciating all the deeper subtext of psychology mm. they were doing right like when we become adults we really are just our childhood selves as in a bigger form right right so, much yeah, of our yeah, emotions. Yeah. so like him coming to confrontation with himself and realizing like all my emotional shit stems from when i was this age right and i'm dealing with that and of course a lot of that is inherited by the experiences he has with his father mark ruffalo you know so you're watching this lineage of mm -hmm. effect and how really the my favorite things about this movie were the relationships and yeah. like like some of the I, I like the action scenes but some of that like big sci-fi mumbo jumbo towards the end is like that really wasn't like my favorite parts of this no. movie yeah were actually like the least interesting stuff like mm -hmm. the more subtle things with time travel but really it was the 
It was the characters. It's the characters. It was the yeah. relationships. The relationships. And yeah, and the they, writing. And how they change. Yeah, that's when it was like the most. The movie. writing was phenomenal. It was really I can't cool. imagine uh, reading that script and just being like, oh shit, this is really, really good. It, yeah. hit, it hits. It hits like home on so many different levels mm -hmm. in so many different ways. Um, the nostalgia was great. They had a lot of references. Yeah. There was like, I mean, there's a lot of Back to the Future. Some parties of like Mark Ruffalo was like a Doc Brown situation, mm -hmm. you know, um, interacting with your mom. Uh, I thought of like Flight of the Navigator. They flat yeah. out call out Terminator at one point, you know. They're Star Wars. <laughs> I felt yeah. like they, they. I mean, we'll we'll get to we'll get to that like yeah. the action, but I felt like they immediately got us with yes. the scene with the uh, and the with his mom mm -hmm. at the bar. Yeah. And you're like, is this going to be played comedy? Is this going to be? And it was just really sweet. Mm -hmm. It was just sweet. And I was like, oh, man, this whole movie is going to have these like really hot, like hitting like, what is it? What is it called? It, it hits you in the feels. Yeah. Like it really just hits you in the feels. Every single one of those family moments. Well, I think what they did well was like making Ryan Reynolds' character someone who's coming to face his trauma right and, and how that's just all within himself yeah and putting his younger self on a path to being a, a happier better person i like that they didn't keep the dad alive either right that they were like that's not the point of the movie is to save the dad the point is how to cope with the grief right which Ooh. i thought was even more powerful that's yeah. what i mean like there's a lot of like there's deeper a lot. family messages here there's so many uh and so i really facing yourself facing yourself is like the biggest thing you know yeah. uh, that line the one that really started, like the one that started messing me up. I, was, I remember you reacted. Okay, but what what was the line? There was the the one about um, your. I know why you're upset. I know why you're angry. Is because he's dead. Yeah, of how it's easy. That's fucking me up right now. <laughs> oh. like, yeah, because it's, it's yeah, it's easy. easier to be. A anger is usually a um, a defense against something deeper. Like right. there's usually something underneath the anger, whether that be sadness or depression or whatever. It's a lot of times it's a defense mechanism mm. is what it is. Yeah. And then so a lot of times it's it, it's like I remember when I was really really little. If if I had a friend or a family member who was moving away, I would just get mad at them and I would just treat them like crap because oh, it's so shit, it's, 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 it's harder to deal personal. with. Yeah. It's harder to deal with the sadness. I'm just I'm just mad at you now. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, but, you, but you don't you don't you just don't realize that when you're when you're doing it it's so subconscious yeah that like oh you're not like a little boy going i am masking my sadness with anger right. you know and so you're watching him grow up into that so i, I think like thanks okay, so this really hit you, this hit home for you yeah it was hitting home for me in yeah. a lot of ways and um and I thought like the, I just thought the all the chemistry was really good. Actually, everybody was so good. Like young him is so good. Well, who's this kid? Walker, Texas Ranger or something. What's Walker, his name? Walker something or another. He's good. What is? Uh, no, it's not on. Oh, it's not on. It's We're not, not on there. Look it up. Um, he's phenomenal. <laughs> this he's kid phenomenal. was great, and he was doing such a good Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was like, whoa. Like I, you don't really look like him, but yeah. yeah. I wonder <laughs> how that was like. I wonder if there was Ryan was like coaching him on like how he would deliver stuff or if he just like watched a bunch of Ryan Reynolds stuff. I think that's I was like it's not even though it doesn't really look like him, what I thought was cool was that they made sure the kid at least I think his first it first time is Walker. Is it like it captures at least the essence of Ryan Reynolds? Absolutely. Yeah. Like he had he had the pentameter of him too and like the just the delivery. Good word. Yeah. Wait, what word did you oh. just say? Pentameter? Yes. What does pentameter mean? Uh, so a... uh, the easiest way would be like ionic pentameter is like Shakespeare. I'm not even gonna pretend to know. It's like yeah, it's like the, the, the numbers, but yeah, pentameter. Good. good the way good the word. way that so. <laughs> yeah. Pentameter. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> so I I felt like that kid really pulled off like that Ryan Reynolds delivery and the way he speaks and mm -hmm. yeah, he was a little shit too. He's a little asshole. I was like, he's this. They made him mean. Yeah, he was mean. And that's what I mean. Is like he hates, he hates his, he hates who he is on the inside. Like Ryan Reynolds, oh, and that's it. But who was on the inside starts at a little boy age, and right. I think that was like so. That, that was like powerful. That is more powerful than a lot of people will realize. Mm -hmm. I think. Yeah, and, I didn't. I yeah. And yeah. yeah, you know, like a lot of the times I'm talking with people or like I haven't been like doing my own little personal help shit mm -hmm. has always been like, oh, yeah, you got to go to those little boy wounds. And <laughs> back right, stuff. Yeah. That's where you got to go to. That's where you got to go to uproot some Ooh. crap so you can change. <laughs> um, 
And then his relationship with even Zoe Saldana, while not like in it a lot, yeah, she's delivered. Oh my god, like her chemistry, her and Ryan Reynolds had great chemistry. Yeah, they were wonderful, wonderful chemistry together. Yeah, I like instantly bought it. And, and for someone with that short of screen presence, yeah, you need to have that kind of instantaneous. It's like, got to be good. Like I believe that love. Yeah, and and that that conflicting choice of like, oh, but I might sacrifice us being together if I if I go back and change this stuff. It had such a potential of getting in the realm of like a parent trappy and it didn't yeah, yeah. and it didn't do yeah, that you yeah. know like it didn't because do you get what i'm saying yeah, like no, it I had do, that I seriousness do. it didn't get into the ch like super cheese it stayed in a perfect family friendly film yeah and i was like i haven't really watched a family friendly film in a long time so it was nice to like see that especially a live action yeah family friendly one it's like the yeah, with heart, they, like that that much of heart. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? A lot of heart, yeah. a lot of wonder. And I thought they mm -hmm. captured brilliantly. Like in terms of like, it's not like it, it does borrow like eighties aesthetic in in a lot of ways. I think even with their design, I thought that was in the neat. clothing and everything yeah. about it. Yeah, all, all all the art, all the like the, the way the ships look, the way the, costumes the coloring, look, yeah, the coloring especially, even being kind of in the woods <laughs> for yeah. a lot of this. Uh, this movie called like Starman that I was thinking of, and so they. They really captured that. I do think, I do think the villain was underwritten. I wasn't a fan of that. Right. Yeah. 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 Uh, I didn't find it threatening or menacing. It's it kind of dull. Like I just didn't even care though because I just loved the family moment so much. Yeah. It was like the bigger shit was. It was. Yeah. Like, like, it, was it was just there. The, the yeah. Particle accelerator. Whatever the hell that thing. Magnetic was like accelerator. The all spark. <laughs> yeah. Like, it was. It was one of. <laughs> yeah. I was like, this is not that. Nobody cares. It started losing me a little yeah. bit. And like the big finale stuff. Like while it's enjoyable, it it, it was not the thing that is it, great about the film. captivating yeah. at all and. It's like the villain stuff is not that interesting. It's it's more interesting when they talk about when they when, when like Zoe Saldana and Ryan Reynolds when they're talking about it. That's more interesting than actually right, cutting yeah. to Catherine Keener and watching her spout some generic. Yeah. That was a lot of that was a lot of um, like exposition of that True. part, and it was yeah. just like they just told us everything. Yeah. You know, or they're just like, okay, this is what's happening, rather than completely showing it. But it doesn't matter. Yeah. Well, it doesn't like, matter. I think I, it was kind of working better when I was just kind of using my imagination of what the future's like. Right. But, but yeah, I do think that whole like big finale thing was, I don't know, I just didn't, I didn't really need something that explosive. It just wasn't like really, cool. even though well, there's some good moments in it. Like I preferred the action scenes earlier on, like the first right. slide, the first time in the woods. With the woods. Down and and we, we had a variety. Yeah, there was a good variety. There was a variety. And, and, and like those I thought were stronger than even the big finale one. Right, you know? yeah. But, but the big finale one's not like my biggest my biggest takeaway. I just like I didn't really care for Catherine Keener. I didn't really like the guy who was the bald headed dude. Yeah. I'm like, why do they keep building this guy up? He seems like he sucks at what he does. He keeps getting his, <laughs> ass, keeps getting his ass kicked. <laughs> we keep having to act like he's the big showdown guy. Right. I'm like, no, not really. I do like that Catherine Keener kills herself in the end when we're just shooting the armor bullet. Right. That was a kind of uh I, I, I was like, yeah, yeah. yeah. I was like, ha, ha. I, I, I was like, ah. <laughs> you care more about money than the power of science. Mm. And if only uh, you invested. But stat cast. Yeah. Like, they're like, okay. And then Mark Ruffalo is going to be the yeah. dad. <laughs> they're just like, all right, let's just. Let's just ask. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just keep going. Like, who else can we get? If Mark Ruffalo was only at, if Mark Ruffalo was barely in it, like he was in it pretty much the last half of the movie. Yeah. If he was, you see, the fact that they cast Mark Ruffalo, automatic, because I really didn't know anything about this movie before watching yeah. it. So the fact that they cast Mark Ruffalo made me go, okay, so we're definitely going to see the dad. Yeah, we're gonna, absolutely. We're definitely going to time travel at some point to see the dad. So that kind of undercuts some of the, like, you're you're kind of anticipating that happening. Yeah. Whereas if they didn't cast Mark Ruffalo, I will. Uh, You'd I'm, just be like, oh, the dad's probably just actually, like. God, yeah. yeah. Like, oh, we're, we're not doing that. Yeah. yeah. But however, Mark Ruffalo's great in this movie, though. Know? So I, I was happy he was here because he was awesome. When they were doing the scene uh, together, like the, like the ending scene when it's a big touching moment of him saying that he loves his son. When he's, you know what I'm talking about? Good Will Hunting right there. It was, like, as I'm watching, I'm like, this is fucking good. And then I was like, I wonder how hard it was for them to shoot this, being, like, so close. See, I like, actually, I did get pulled out going. I like, pulled there's out. There's probably all, so many bloopers. I was like, <laughs> I, yeah, I, I literally did that. Yeah. I did that. I was like, huh. 
Yeah, I wonder how how long this took for them to do. Cause Ryan's like crying in it, and I'm like, whoa. Oh, yeah. Like I, they really, I mean, they're they're serious actors, but like, I I wonder how hard it was because you always see them in like a comedy version. Like this was very yeah. touching. Yeah, I wonder yeah. how serious they kept the set. I mean, there are actors who are pro enough to be able to like still be like still be yeah, yeah, yeah. goofing around in between takes and stuff, but. Yeah, I did get a little pulled out because I'm like, I'm so used to seeing Mark Ruffalo doing interviews and being a goofball. I'm so yeah. used to Ryan Reynolds just like, possibly being a goofball that I was like, they must have like ribbed each other a little yeah, bit during these moments. <laughs> yeah. But they brought it. I was like, damn. Yeah. That scene was very Goodwill hunting. It was. Yeah. Um, I would like to see Ryan Reynolds in more serious roles. Like hey, after watching fun. this, I'm like, can we can we get some sort of like Oscar? type of film to yeah. do, you know what I mean? I think he would kill it. Like mm. he hasn't really done, a, it's always like a free guy or like a comedy or something in, a, in those veins, you know? I think, I mean, that's a, the thing with Red Notice was that's that's part of why I wasn't I wasn't super into Red Notice. Okay, uh, but yeah, I hadn't seen it. So is that one of the ones that's kind of like more was, serious? Yeah, but a lot of people like, apparently it's like the most viewed movie on Netflix. Uh, but is <laughs> it also like Ryan Reynolds being Ryan Reynolds? It's or is odd. It, it is like, Ultimate Ryan it Reynolds. It is like feeling. ultimate Ryan Reynolds feet. Nah, I want to see him more vulnerable like this. Like this I like the great. mix. Yeah. yeah, the mixture of it all. Like I love his yeah. Deadpool. Like I, I loved him in Buried. Uh, mm. I thought he was even like Amityville oh, Horror. Oh, Buried. Remake. Yeah. yeah, Buried was yeah. good. He's done a lot. Of, he's he's. A, I think he's a really great actor, and I even think he brings variety in Free Guy. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I would like to see him kind of do a little bit more of these. I like when you like he doesn't have the mask on. It doesn't have a mask on. You can see him actually doing the action too. Right. Um. But at the same time, it's like as much as this was like Ryan Reynolds' movie, it still felt like an ensemble. Oh, know? absolutely! And I, and I think that's really cool that like it didn't turn into solely the Ryan Reynolds show when I, it, when it could have been. I love that. Like, if I was a little kid, I'd probably watch this movie all the time. Yeah. Like this is such a that like time frame of your life that mm -hmm. you you would watch this over and over again. So it's it was nice to see that sort of film. Absolutely. Yeah, because I haven't seen that in a long time. I'm watching like. Euphoria and like crazy, crazy <laughs> shit. Like it was nice to like come down from this like, you know, let's watch something that's a little bit more not crazy in your face all the time and shocking and you know. Well, it's like one of those PG thirteen family films. Yeah, that has like peril and like stuff. we just yeah. watched the Batman. Like and were, <laughs> like I was watching the Batman and Euphoria. Like that's where my cinema has yeah. gone. You know, like this. So it's nice. It was nice to see a brightly lit film yeah. with these primary colors and being like yeah we don't gotta be all like crazy and dark all the time I but like, like yeah we do but like sometimes this is nice i it's uh, it's cool to see a movie that literally all ages can enjoy yeah. this one like yeah all, all ages. ages like you're not gonna be a dad or a mom who's like i'm gonna sort of watch this for my kid you know like my mom is gonna love this i think i think a my lot brother's of gonna love this this yeah. could be a, like an early blockbuster for the i hope it doesn't just fly under the radar that was great yeah it was really good and this kid's a star this kid's a star guys yeah. we have done it we have done it we have talked about the adam project thank you so much guys for being here thank you our shot for being here you know what I'm saying? Thank you, Greg, for being you. <laughs> Talk, Thank, talking to you, little Greg. boy, Greg. Talking <laughs> to you, little boy, Greg. You're doing, you did good today. You did a good video today, Greg, little boy, Greg. You're doing good on the channel. Keep it up. <laughs> anyway. Just, just edit that part out for yourself. Yeah. Replay it. Just a clip. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thanks to the boys at Prepper. Check us on Patreon. Your support means a lot. We'll catch you guys soon.